Melotera, the name comes from a set of converging challenges. The challenges coming from the technology push, looking at nanotechnology, nano devices, nano sensors, basically the materials, functional materials, and then the Terra scale communication challenges that arise when we have big system put together, when different components have to work together, so you have issues related to complexity, to system design, to software, to communication, and so on. What is in practice NanoTerra? It is a partnership. It involves the two polytechnics in Switzerland, Lausanne and Zurich, the Cantonal University of Basel, Geneva, Neuchâtel, and Lugano, and CSEM, which is the Swiss Center for Electronics and Microtechnology in Neuchâtel. Uh, the, despite the structure of the consortium, the uh, grants are available to researchers in Switzerland in any of the Swiss institution. Uh, that could be either university or non-profit research institutions. So how do all these uh, participants distribute in the Swiss landscape? This map, you have uh, circles here proportional to the number of groups, the total of 105 groups. And really interesting, actually, is to have a visual perception of the networking we have between all these different groups in Switzerland, covering the French-speaking part, Swiss-German, and Italian, Swiss-Italian-speaking part. Now, graphical visual understanding is quite useful when one wants to get a vision of this whole program and what's your position in all this and how all these institutions are networked. We have here the backbone in red of all the RTD projects. You also have the NTF and ED at the bottom here, and you see all these networked institutions to these different projects with uh, ETH board members, QS members, OFFT members, and others, uh, special research institutions and industries that were willing to be actually co-PIs and not uh, just third parties. So both type of contributions are extremely welcome and this gives us a nice overview of the uh, full scope of this network. The challenge of NanoTerra was to bring together the Nano and the, and the Terra expertise together for new challenges for developing complex engineered systems. The PI and co-PI backbone network, which is represented here, you can see, for example, if you pick up an example here, you take the Simosaic project, you see the different the PI connected in red, the different co-PIs, and you have all the network links giving you a quick insight and also identifying the co-PIs or PIs that are networked to different projects. So